That's so cool. I don't know if you can see it or not, but oh yeah, you can see it. It's like a rainbow spot. A rainbow spot. <laughs> it looks so cool. What is it, Woogie? Hey guys, so um, today was nice for the most part. I went to um, church this morning and um, during RC, my RCIA class, um, um, I got into, I kind of like, my, or I should back up, my deacon was talking about how um, it's a sin to miss mass and like miss a weekend of going to church and stuff and because you're supposed to uh, respect the Sabbath and stuff and blah 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 which is Sunday for Catholics I yeah and um, he li like I told him like the first weekend we started meeting like I'm not gonna agree with everything y'all say you know, um, and when he said that, when he was saying that, saying that, he was looking right at me, and I, like, I just rolled my eyes, because he knows I think it's bullshit, so, yeah, anyway, I don't think it's a sin if I miss church every once in a while, you know, so, yeah, anyway, that was kind of, I kind of find that funny, but yeah, anyway, mom and I also went to the dollar store and got some little decorations and some stuff we needed. Um, one of the things we got was these Thanksgiving-ish, fall-ish window clings, and I just put them on um, one of my mirrors, which I just thought they were really cute. I, I especially like this turkey. Um, so yeah, that's a thing. Oh, this scarecrow's pretty cute too. But yeah, anyway, and I also grabbed a few of these um, flower things from the dollar store. I already had the vase and I just stuck them together for a little Christmassy thing and stuff and I got some white ones back there and what else? Um, I forget what else I got. Oh, I got some Christmassy ones. You can see those ones and these ones which are super cute um but yeah and then I got the Santa one up there and I have um I think I have a few over here yeah I have a few over here there's those four and you can see a little gingerbread dude over there um so yeah those are kind of the little um decoration-esque things that we got, um, oh, and we got those, um,
placemats, Christmas placemats, which I always a little, I'm a little uh, excited for Christmas, so I kind of put them out. But yeah, anyway, um, I don't remember if I mentioned this last night or not, but my grandmother is in the hospital again. Um, she was having trouble breathing most of yesterday, and um, last night about 10 o'clock or so, um, Mom, my my mom drove um, her to the ER, and she was admitted, um, which I wasn't surprised. Um, and sh they ran some blood work, and some something in her blood levels was like higher than usual. And um, we knew before that she was having some trouble with her kidneys, but. Um, it wasn't bad enough to where they really needed to give her any meds for it or anything. Um, just monitor it, kind of. But it's apparently progressed, and whatever's wrong with her kidneys has progressed. Um, so, yeah. Um, well, I kind of know what's going on with her kidneys. She has congestive heart... F My grandmother has congestive heart failure, so she's on diuretics, I believe, so that fluid doesn't build up around her heart and, her, and her, in her lungs and stuff, but on the other hand, that's fucking up her kidneys, the diuretics or whatever. Um, so for whatever's wrong with her kidneys, um, they want to put her on, um, what is it? I don't know, it's, I forget what it's called. I want to call it, um, it's not a blood transfusion. It's like where they clean your blood, like, three or four times a week. I'm forgetting what it's called at the moment, but, um, yeah, the only issue, the only issue with that is she would have to, I think she would have to be taken off the heart, like, the diuretics. But she can't really be taken off the diuretics because of her congestive heart failure. And also, if she goes on this, whatever the hell it's called, um, when she's on it, you pretty much have to stay on it because your kidneys are like, eh, fuck it, I don't have to do any work because once you start it, they're just like, whatever. Um, so once you start it, you have to keep doing it. Um, and my grandmother's not sure if she wants to do that or not, so she's struggling on deciding if she wants to do that. Um, plus, she's not sure if she can actually get out like four times a week in order to do this. Whatever it is. Um, like, I know what, it's on the tip of my tongue, I know what it is. Um, but I just can't spit out the name of it. Um, but yeah, that's what's going on. Um, if she was like 10 years younger and her health was better, um, then she, I don't think she would necessarily hesitate to do it, but, um, she's 85, I think, 80, I think she's in her mid 80s, and with the congestive heart failure and diabetes and blah, she was anemic, um, her iron count or something was really low, so they gave her two pints of blood, I believe? I'm not sure. Anyway, I'm rambling way too much about this. Um, other than that, today was really nice. Um, oh, funny story. Um, during mass this morning, um, Father Fosto, our priest, was, um, talking about how, um, how they, how the people were reinstalling the air conditioner and stuff because we got a new air conditioning system. And how some of the lights went out and stuff in the, um, sanctuary. And the two that are right over the stage were off. And, um, he was joking around saying, 
these two lights are off, those two lights are off, and these two right over the altar are off. And we can't get them to turn back on. Let's pray that they turn back on. And as soon as he finished saying that, the two lights over the altar turned on. It was hysterical. And the look on his face was just priceless. And um, after they came on, he was like, And let there be light. He's Italian, by the way, so... Um, it was just funny, because the look, the look on his face was the best. So, um... Yeah, and the whole congregation um, just started cracking up and clapping, so, um, yeah, anyway, um, you had to be there. It was really funny. Um, anyway, I will stop rambling, and I'll talk to y'all tomorrow. Bye.